What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's Professor Anime coming back at you with another video. So here I am today about to go into the live reaction of Tokyo Ghoul chapters 99 through 107. If this turns out to be a long video, I am sorry, but hopefully my reaction makes up for it for what's about to go down in these few chapters of Tokyo Ghoul that I'm about to react to. So without further ado, Let's get this started. Chapter 99, The Unknown. Dr. Kano? Oh. And Rize there, man. She's still alive. She's still being probed. Look, she's looking. Oh my god. Her eyes are bleeding. She naked too. She is alive. Tatara said she was murdered. Does Algiri not know the truth either? You made it all the way here. I see there's no need to hide the truth any longer. You who once who had a human body can now compete with the strongest of ghouls. You've managed to come this far on your own strength. I suppose my attempt to control Kuroto and Shiro's strength by killing them, uh, by, by killing their emotions, can be called a failure. You are like my ultimate creation, Kaneki. Doctor, you really were using Rize to create ghouls, but why? That's true. Why? Why do you think tamed birds don't freely roam the skies above? Because their bird cages are not of their own making. That begs the question, who was the one who made this world's cage? What is he talking about? And I realized that this twisted bird cage is holding our world back. I want to break this cage open. In order to do that, I needed the most effective means at my disposal. In other words, ghouls. But not, but just not any ghoul I need. Ghouls artificially made powerful by heterosis. One-eyed ghouls. They would become the one ray of hope that pierces this overcast sky. For this cause, I sacrificed everything and experimented endlessly, but my experiment success rate refused to rise above 0%. The stomach's RC cell limit was a part of it. I discovered that as long as the nutrient supply was regulated, it would self-replicate and recover. It was only the most basic of framework, but it was a predestined. Birdcage, ray of hope, blah 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 blah. That load of shit is your excuse for turning me into this? I'm a doctor. The fact that I saved your life hasn't changed. Yes, but you caused a lot of shit for Kaneki. Oh my god. You have no idea what kind of life I've been forced to live since then. You're no doctor. Yep, I knew it. Yeah, <laughs> dude. I sure you saved Kaneki's life, but you fucked him over in the process. You're a fucking psycho. Oh man, the artwork is getting so... It's getting much darker right now. Semantics. Now that I care what you think, no doubt the world views my work as evil. Soon there'll be no place left for me to hide. I'm glad I had the chance to talk to you before it got too late. My experiment was a success, just as I'd anticipated. No more will I have. No, no more will I live like this, constantly hiding away. I have already gone. I've already given up on living in a world of man any longer. I knew it. Because, you know, if the doc Basically, the doctor is a ghoul now, right? Because it just makes sense, the way everything's been playing out. Because if he's been experimenting on Rize and made artificial ghouls like Kaneki, Shiro, and Kuro, then he would have had to become a ghoul himself, you know? Kaneki, won't you come with me to Algiri? If you intend to live in a world of ghouls, it'd be a prudent to join hands with ghouls separate you separate you may be enemies but together you would have reliable allies the hell are you saying this me join an organization like that I don't think so then allow me to rephrase join me instead I will show you the true form of this world true form that's right the other side of this world the hidden truth if you don't truly understand you've never been able to see reality for what it is you might even come to change your mind once you see for yourself for example the one behind the reason for the creation of our tree is the ghoul named yashimoto really really the old dude he created algiri well, you know, that is, the, yeah, I can see that, because maybe, 
you know, Yashimuro had to come from a different ward and probably was very hostile, but, you know, he turned over a new leaf, a new peaceful leaf, so, yeah, I, I, I can, yeah, I guess I can see that coming. Why would the manager's name come up in this conversation? It has to be a lie, but how does Kano know about the manager? Furthermore, he also knows about ghouls. You were only ever forced to dance at others' whims like a puppet until now. You had no choice in the matter. However, if you choose to follow me, I will show you this world just as it is, and how beautiful this world can be. This is shit. I can't. Kaneki, the manager in Algiri, I, yes, I will. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, oh, wait, whoa. Wait, the glass broke. Did Rize jump out somehow? What's going on? The donor. On that day, you said to me I can walk my path alone. So walk your path. Don't stray. Yomo going in, dude. Yes. <laughs> dude, he saves Rize. He saves Rize. Oh, shit. Kaneki's like, what? Yomo, Rize, Yomo, wait. Ken, be careful. The white doves are coming. It's just like in War 24. The stuff again, it's been a while. This stuff again, it's been a while. How annoying. Aw, oh, crap. They brought Juzo too, and they got Amon, my dog. What a surprise. He's not your average doctor. Prepare for battle. All right, here we go. Heading into chapter 100. Centipede. Oh, here we go. Why is Yomo here? And why did he take Rize away? Is the manager behind this as well? Damn it, I don't understand anything again. The doves are here. I need to get back to everyone. No! Kano! Ooh, dang, Kaneki got destroyed. Dang, look at him. You're no match for me yet. In the world of man, I trained in martial arts, and with the body of ghouls, I have refined it. This is completely different from your training, kid. Your heart is too stubborn. And thus, the stubborn must bend. There is no path this way. Know your powerlessness. Wait! Oh, the failed experiments are coming out. Kaneki, enjoy playing with your little brothers. Though they might be failures, even you should have trouble with that many. I look forward to the day we meet again. Kaneki, no! Know my powerlessness. Ugh. Ever since the day I woke up as a ghoul, it's been erasing my weaknesses to protect that was important to me. In this world, the strong devour the weak. Who is the strongest? I, oh dang, Kaneki! He's, dude, he's like, I fucking am, yo! Oh my god, he's cracking his fingers again. Get in my way. Oh, sh special class, Shinohara. Suzy has lost control again. Oh, great. <laughs> I'll, take this, I'll take this side. Uh, half of the supporting squad with me, the other half with Amon. Let's go! Shinohara, sir. Be careful. Yeah, you guys too. Let's go, Akira. I have a bad feeling about this. Don't let your guard down. You don't say. These RC cells, walls, and these signs of human experimentation. What is this Dr. Kono up to? Oh, there's Shiro and Kuro. That brat. Shiro Papa. He needs us. Um, oh, huh. These are some familiar faces. There's Suzuya. Otherwise known as Juzo. I'm just going to say Juzo. <laughs> Kurona and Nashino, right? You? Ray? Oh, yeah, that's right. In the anime, they really didn't show a backstory on how exactly Juzo knows these uh, ghouls here. Well, technically, these were humans at a time before, but it's Juzo Suzia. Now, second class investigator Juzo Suzia. Investigator? To think they're using you of all people. They must be crazy. What's up with those eyes? They're red, you know. You quit being human? We've no interest in a twisted world. We don't need humanity. Aw, that sure is something, you know. Oh, I've always wondered if if I were to stretch your intestines out side by side, which one would be longer? I'm an investigator, and you are ghouls. There shouldn't be a problem if I were to kill you, right? Dude, he brought out Jason. He brought out Jason. Those Kagane, could it be Gourmet and the one who escaped from the 13th Ward? Naki, I thought I could smell familiar scent. Doves? A troublemaker from the 20th Ward and one of the five escapes from the S level. They'll make for some good material. Shit, now the doves are here as well. How am I supposed to deal with both them and this Americano guy? 
Monsieur. I said that, mo not my name. I have a proposal if you may. Okay, could we perhaps forge an alliance for the assistance? Now you want to forge an alliance? Four gem lions? <laughs> Four gem lions, what the f- The level of your ignorance astounds me. I meant let's fight the doves together. Oh, right, then I don't have to fight as many. Alright, let's do this, lions. The amazing Naki will not be caged twice in Kokoria. I trust you have my back then. Monsieur, I shall finish you off once you're tired. He might get a little weird, but he's not such a bad guy after all. RC walls, huh? Hell, it seems like we're in a haunted house. Where are we? It looks like a laboratory. A corpse? Is it a ghoul? Who are you? No, no matter who you are, anyone who gets in my way will be... Are you the boss around here? What kind of cognate is that? It looks just like a... Said to be- Oh, shit! Oh my god, dude! Look at Kaneki's Kagane! You rat- Dude, oh my- Look at his face! Dude! Holy crap! Alright, chapter 101 now. Kaneki goes berserk as a centipede. It's coming. Deploy your king case. Your- Quin case? I, I, I can't- I'm trying to pronounce it right. Alright. Dude, he going in. He's about to fuck up Shinohara. Ooh! Smash to the ground! Way too close. My spine would be in pieces if I hadn't activated my Arata in time. The ghoul, it isn't complete, but could it be? A Kakuja? Uh, yeah, the Kakuja is supposed to be, like, technically the most powerful ghoul. As far as what I know, I think. Kakuja... Yeah, they're like, the next evolution to ghouls, I guess you could say. Evolution progresses, see, yeah, see, they're talking about evolution now. <laughs> evolution progresses seems to be around 50%. Are you a half Kagaja? Centipede? Kagaja? That damn Kano, what exactly is this place? Although you aren't our objective, as an investigator, we can't ignore a ghoul as dangerous as you. Ooh, Shinohara, going in. Kokokata by Kaku. Oni Yamadawan. I never thought something like this would happen. Don't panic, just support the uh, special class investigators. Amon Akira. Is backup possible? I've got a nasty one here. Mother, mother, oh, I'm so fucked up. Me, myself, I, I will protect. Dude, Kaneki is going insane. Look at that grin on his face. Oh my god. Dude. We're also currently in combat. We'll reinforce you as soon as possible. Hello? Oh! Sub, big guy. Get a call from Yama. Naki. What up? Elbow to the face? Come on, Amon. You gotta get up, man. You might have a kinke, but you only got two arms. A Kagane is much better. Ooh, what happened there? What the? Oh! Akira saved Amon. Nice. S rank Ghoul Naki. So you were a Kokaku type. I do want to use my Ridden Kaku Kinke, but shame I didn't bring it. I only have my Bai Kaku. Ooh, dang! And Kokaku! She freaking just spears him right through the chest. Bai Kaku and Kokaku Amatsu. Trash should be thrown out. Die. Like daughter. Or, like father, like daughter. Ah, it hurts. Wow, that's... Chimera Kinke. A Kinke combined of two different types of Kagane. A useful weapon capable of opposing multiple types of ghouls. Due to the technical difficulty in infusing the two types of Kagane, final products that can be used in the field are extremely rare. That's a nice Kagane. Why don't I take it out? Now, now, we can't let this happen, can we, Monsieur? <laughs> Shoe coming in! Did he combine the separated Kura into one? Thank you, investigator. Don't be sur don't be uh don't be surrounded. Okay, okay, don't be surrounded. I know. What's with the ghouls here and the ghoul Shinohara encounter? What the hell is going on around here? Is Juzo going to be all right alone? It's, dude, I'm on. You don't have to worry about Juzo. You don't have to worry about Juzo. This little brat. This is great fun, feels just like A-Class Reunion. 
please show me your guts! You psycho, the one who gets to see his guts is you. Ooh! Shizuo got... What, or... Did I say Shizuo? Wow, okay. <laughs> Juzo got fucked up. I see him. You see what? You see what? Alright, heading into chapter 102 now. Oh, a little kendo class going on? What is this? Was, oh, was out Kuro and Shiro? In the end, the final match is between the twins again. The juniors can't be an opponent for them. I lost. Payback for last time. Yasuhisa Nashiro, 15 CCG Academy Junior. Nashushisha Kurono, 15 CCG Academy Junior. Their future looks promising. Other than their normal work, the CCG accepts the orphan victims who lost their parents because of ghouls. They are given an education and living support. Many of the CCG orphans participate in the extracurricular activities after school, like training in martial arts to train their body and mind. When they turn 18, more than half of them enroll in the academy, and after two years of training, they become ghoul investigators. Since many of the orphans harbor hatred for the ghouls, it was natural for them to end up being ghoul investigators. The two of us had the same future waiting for us as well. That guy again in this place. And that's when they met Juzo. Suzia Re. Nashiro. Nashiro Kurona. What are you doing here? Returning from the extracurricular activities. You should show up sometime. No way. Ray was a strange guy. Without showing up to classes or extracurriculars, he either wanders around or is absent minded all day long. What are you doing? Crushing insects? <laughs> Crushing insect? Stop it. Not sure whether he's a boy or a girl. Even with the CCG orphans who have all kinds of situations, he was noticeably special. I think it's probably someone from the faculty or from the facility because it looks like this was done in the middle of the night. From the facility, this is someone from within us cadets or someone from the staff. Did you see Suzia in the middle of the night, Ray? We didn't see him. Do you suspect Ray did this? No? Hmm. It's just that it looks like Suzia's background is a bit special. What do you mean by special? Uh, no. If you're saying this, does this mean we're not special? This is a bit troublesome. Hmm. There's rumors that Suzia was kidnapped by a ghoul when he was young. Being changed up, but who was he kidnapped by? He's a human raised by a ghoul, so you end up suspecting him a little. I wonder why did the infield instructor say that? I hate chatter. Me too. Ray was raised by a ghoul. So what? I don't think he's that bad of a guy. Yeah, the ghouls. The ghouls are the ones that derailed your fates and mine and stole many people's futures and continue to do so. The ones distorting the world are the ghouls from the ghouls I and a superior of mine have captured. There was one like that. First class amount. Thank you for your story. I learned a lot from hearing the story about the captured of Red Jam. Yasushisa, was it? I heard rumors about you from instructors that you two are very talented sisters. Um, can women become great investigators like First Class Imon? There are many excellent female investigators, Miss Yasura from HQ, and my partner, First Class Mado's wife. At 28, she became an associate special class. She even served in an instructor position. Amazing, a female associate special class? Did that person become a special class investigator? No, not exactly. I wonder if that girl will be able to meet her papa and mama. She'll meet them, definitely. Ray, what are you doing? Nashiro Kurana, good evening. Ray, aren't you sad? About what? About that girl. Uh, she died? Stop saying it that way, it feels wrong. Why? She just died. How is that different from eating meals or playing? Ray, if that's a joke, it's not funny. Annoying. Joke? What is a joke? Plenty of people die somewhere all the time. She's just one of them. Why? Isn't she a friend from the same facility? You. That. The killings of the living things in the facility were all done by Ray. What? Ten dogs and forty cats. If we count the small creatures, it becomes much more than that. Ray was a zero. He was empty. Ray was zero. Ray was a zero. He was empty. 
<laughs> the organs will spill out. <laughs> You're not suitable even as a mock or alley of justice. Ugh. Don't think badly of us, Ray. They're going in for the attack. Whoa. 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 What? Same here. I don't think badly of me. Did she? Did Juzo just throw a... Uh, a knife in... Yashiru, the, 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 the black one, the black one, the, Kuro, I'm gonna call her Kuro, okay? Did he throw a knife in her eye? What the heck? Alright, heading on to chapter 103. Kuro! I'm okay, it'll heal. <laughs> okay, heal, Scorpion, Bikaku. Will you make it in time? Dude, Chuzo. God, does it hurt? Please enjoy 45 more. He's gonna stab her 45 more times. I worked hard to steal these. Dude, he is stabbing her repeatedly. Oh my god. Dude. And he's just walking. He, he's just walking away. Because I killed a fair number of ghouls, I roughly know what I need to destroy for them to break properly. Next, I will break Kurono's important thing. So this is Rei, haha, ha, really, without any mercy. Next, Kurono's important thing, which is her sister, right? I'm sure that to my existence is is the same as the ants that you were crushing at that time. Rei? Someone like that. Oh my. Shiro, stop! Kurono's important thing, yep. Dude. Juzo. Maniac, dude. Maniac. Just freaking sliced her in half. Well, I don't know in half, but that's what it looks like. Dude. That was pretty long, wasn't it? Nashiro! Oh my god. Look at her face. Kuro. Kuro no Onicha. Dude. Is she gonna die? Who was the one that truly killed your parents? Who was the one that you should exact revenge on? I will tell you. Scared? It's scary, but because you're with me, then let's begin. There's the doctor and how they became ghouls. They wake up the next day, they're ghouls, I'm fine. I'm not scared. They're holding each other's hand. Oh my god. Juzo, Juzo. oh, next Kuronaga, should I fight? Can I win, can I win? Getting revenge. Oh, does nothing at this rate. Nashiro will die. She might still be saved. Yes, Papa can save her. I have to find Papa. Aw, my inside spilled out. <laughs> okay, that was a little bit of comic relief right there. Juzo just going like, aw, my inside spilled out, you know? <laughs> Before it becomes sore, I have to fix it. It's okay, Nashiro. Papa will do something about this. Hey, Nashiro, I will save you because we will always be together. Missed. Well, at least they got away. I mean, they're not really bad types of ghouls, really. I mean, they're, they're, they're really just the same as Kaneki, really. If anything, they are just confused. That's technically what they are. His dodging ability is extremely good. We have to aim from somewhere closer. A half Kakuja, Rinkaku. This is the worst opponent for Arata to deal with. Can a single... Oni Yamada pull through? All the injustice in this world is a result of one's lack of ability. That's why Ryoku-san's death is my fault. Moku-san and Tetsu-san, Kei-san and Koto-kun, it's all my fault that they died. If I'm weak, everyone will be killed. Everyone important, everyone in Anteku, and Banjo-san and the others, and Tokuchan and Hide. To live is to eat others. That's why I will eat. It can't be helped, right? Because you're getting in my way. Dude. <laughs> Kaneki going in, dude. Kaneki going in. You're half killed. That oh, is he about? Dude, what the heck is going on here? Twist and cut. Fingers with pliers. Put a centipede inside of my ear. Go on a date to the bookstore and have your insides gen gently scrambled. Among all the ghouls I ever met, 100, or 1,000 minus 7, 1,000 minus 7, 1,000 minus 7, is what 
you are by far the craziest one. Dude, oh, things are getting good. All right, we got about three more chapters heading into chapter 104 right now. So let's get right into it. As expected with this number, it's a number. It's a wonder why they teamed up, but our opponent is Naki from the 13th and Gourmet from the 20th. It could have been different if Special Investigator Shinohara is here, but for now, let's retreat. We're gonna surround them. Shinohara? Kanaki kun. <laughs> In these past six months, you held out your hunger by feeding on your own kind of ghouls. You're feeding on your own kind ghouls. No. The point wasn't to fill this hunger, you wanted to increase your ghoul powers to get strength to resist our Giri, right? I also heard about that rumor. I didn't think that within that short period of time Kaneki couldn't would get to that level as a ghoul, but cannibalism would only ruin a ghoul. It's a chaotic power and to go against that Aogiri's mustache while not having your own consciousness is possible for not. I'm not sure. So. So Kaneki actually did end up eating ghouls. I remember, I remember in the uh, chapters he went to the uh, uh, the uh, um, restaurant, the one that he went to when he first arrived in the gourmet arc. There was a lot of those ghouls there, and I remember, yeah, I remember that Kaneki and the rest of his team ended up going there to, I guess, kill the ghouls that were there. But I was like, why? I didn't really understand that. But I guess now, Kaneki actually did kill, and it was just so he can cannibalize them. That, I, 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 I hmm, I'm still a little bit confused on that. Because I thought Kaneki was someone who wouldn't kill, you know, but I guess, but I mean, yes, he is, he is going to have to be forced to kill in order to actually you know, get out of the shit that he's currently in with this uh, newfound, uh, you know, awakening that he's gone through. So I, I guess I can understand that. And also, if by any chance there is even a single special investigator in this ghoul investigate, if there is even a single special investigator in this ghoul investigator group, the outcome of the battle could change very differently. Shinohara, I've heard of that name. And to us ghouls, the things we heard are not pleasant things unbelievably strong. If Kaneki Kun was by any chance slaughtered by Aragiri or CCG, sheath your swords, quickly! Even their underlings are annoying, no other choice but to kill one by one. Hmm, I guess I'll test this out. Hey, I'll cut to you into small pieces, you pigs. With this kind of situation, we have the upper hand. Depending on how it turns out, I have to ask you to die. What the hell is that? Oh, is that like a flashbang or something? No, it's a gas grenade. What, what's happening to the Kagane was? Oh, no. It's... It begins by affecting the respiratory system and mucous membranes. And due to the RC cells activating, it stops Kagane from working. A medicine to control RC cells. It's still a prototype, but if you do, direct, if you do get a direct hit, it should produce some results. I should report it to the professor. My body feels weak. It controls RC cells. This is bad. Be cool. Be cool. And to begin with, the annoying two little pricks over there die. Oh, he taking it in. Jason's little brother taking it in. Oh, that hurt. That really hurts. I feel like crying. When you're twins, it means you get two chances, but you also get double the trouble, which means the chance of dying is also doubled. Just when I thought I couldn't meet with your big bro Yomori when I actually went to the outside world, he wasn't there. Of course, I cried every night. Even when I try to remember it now, I always get all tears. Which is why at least I won't let the remaining guys die compared to crying a lot. Oh my god, everybody is going batshit crazy in this manga. <laughs> Crying while in pain is multiple times bad. What? I don't freaking care if it's just JRT gas or whatever. I'll show you how Jason from the 13th does things. That hurts you bad. I'm taking this juicy part. Oh, she got, he gonna take your leg. Oh, and he is... Oh, he chopped down on her leg, guys. He chopped down on her leg. And then she kicks him to the face. Delicious, you trash. Pull, come, come, Kagane. Is he trying to pull out his own Kagane out? What the heck? Dang, look at Aemon's face. That's my dog right there. Yes. 
Look at that face. I want to use that for my thumbnail, but I'm probably not because, oh, that looks awesome. That, look at, I look at Amon's face on page 10 of chapter 104. He going in. He freaking straight up. Oh, dang. This doesn't look good. We're going to retreat for now, Amon. So, yeah, carry me. You were just foolish, but at least you were honest. Tres bien. As a gentleman, I give you my respect, Matsuet Naki. The the other please hold on for just a little bit more. Dude, Kanaki going in. So that's a Kakuja. Isoyama san, what exactly is a Kakuja? Isn't that just purely a monster? Even within the ghouls, they're one of the most annoying ones. Due to cannibalism, the RC cells went under development. Apparently, this happens very rarely. Even if it's only a half Kakuja, this is the first time I've seen one. If you just take one hit from it, you can expect your body to be in pieces. Not being able to block it if it gets close is the biggest problem. But, first class investigator Shinohara is battling with that Kakuja. I wonder if he can win. That's true, because he's holding his own against the Kakuja. First class investigators are in a sense a monster in the human side. I know full well how remarkable Shinohara's deeds are. The invulnerable Shinohara. He studied under investigator Iba Fuji 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 Shije Fu, or Fuji I can't pronounce this guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> Who was a Baikaku user veteran and back from when uh, he was a trio with Mado Kuredo, he achieved a lot of things. He experienced the Owl War that happened 10 years ago, and he was also a very important investigator. And with those achievements, there are also two that stood out. Investigator Killer Oni Yamadara, the, the Obliterator, and Absolute Shield Physical Body Arata Kagujo, the Corpse Picker. Oni Yamada is a ghoul that wrestles to raise the fame and kill the associate uh, special class investigators and first class investigators at the spot. It became a big topic back then even when Shinohara was still a first class investigator he handled Oriyamada who went out of control. And then there's Arata, Kakuja, the corpse picker. He was a ghoul who cannibalized his own kind, picking up their corpses here and there and ate them. After following the Kakuja's traces, the location was found. It was confirmed that they all struggled to death. It's only recently that I heard about Arata's use of Kinkes. It quickly became one of CCG's biggest harvests. Shinohara's strength lies in his persistence. He's someone who's not as flashy as Special Investigator Arima, but would still leave some solid results. I'll use this Kinke and destroy any new opponents. Avoiding hits on dead angles, that experience, and that stamina, that's exactly why he's called the Invertible Shinohara. This bastard surpassed Arata. What a guy. But still, on this side... Ooh! Shinohara, did he just slice through Kaneki? There is still a lot I need to do for Kami-san and those little kids around. Dang, dude. Dang. All right, chapter 105. Oh my, he did split Kaneki. Or he didn't split him in two, but he freaking cut. He, it looked like he cut him in half, but dude, look at Kaneki's face. He is like on the verge of death, but at the same time, he totally has lost like reality. He's lost in touch of reality right now. He did it. I'll never be able to do that. Now, if only it reached the co- Kokakuha, then, oh shit, what is Kaneki, oh my god, what is going on here, oh, are you kidding me, he's still got another Kagane with him, just how many Kagane does he have, what, so I've been bitten, don't you agree, just in a bit. Sukiyama-san, Sukiyama-san, what's wrong? Right now is a critical moment. Well, now that we've been got now the translations in this, I'm sorry guys, from where I'm like viewing this, like the translations are really not that great. So I'm gonna have to compensate that with my own grammar. 
Well, now that we have gone away from Naki, why don't we discuss that we should be... Where should we be going from now on? Isn't that pretty obvious to you idiots? Of course, it's searching for Kaneki-kun. But we think that we should be grouping with Banjo-san first. Banjo-san will just be fine. He should be just 100% healthy. Kaneki-kun is very strong. I think he should be doing just fine too. But Banjo-san is... Banjo-san doesn't have... You know, uh, Kagane. He can't use his Kagane. Tsukiyama is only wanting to go to Kaneki because he wants to rescue Kaneki because he wants to eat Kaneki in the very end. <laughs> He's just going for his own problems. Hmm, that's not the problem now, you idiots. Well then, why don't we divide our part? I'll be searching for Kaneki-kun while you guys will... But the opponent is that black and white sibling. There's no way we can go up against them. If you're really our ally, then please, come with us. <laughs> Look at Tsukiyama, he's like, are you serious? <laughs> you guys are really nosy. You know, you know why? Why do you? Who do you think you are in order? It, who do you think you are ordering me around like that? That's right. Why don't we make it that you guys died on the way? What? For your, for your kind of guys, I don't even need my Kagane. Then let me show you what a real goal is like. He's gonna kill. He's gonna kill his teammates, man. Tsukiyama, what do you think you're doing to my friends? Oh, Banjo-san. You guys are fine, right? Don't touch me. <laughs> As I thought, you really can't be trusted. That one just now. Just kidding, just a joke. You know, hey, smile a bit. That wasn't a joke. But Banjo-san, where have you been? Don't fool around. Don't tell me you've been hiding all this time. I went after those black-white twins, but then I saw them sulking on the ground. Then I got hit. More importantly, where's Kaneki? We were just going for him just now. Then hurry up, of course. How do I say it? I feel like something weighing on my back. Like something's bad about to happen. I won't die. There's still a cat waiting for me to feed at home. <laughs> but then it's really hard for me to believe that a facility as big as this was only for Kaneki himself. There must be something bigger behind this. Is that a girl? It's a ghoul. Oh, Amon's gonna see... His uh, fellow classmates. Well, actually, technically, well, yeah, yeah, classmates, yeah, because he was the teacher, you know. And, and yeah, okay. You are Yashu Hisa. Wait, Aman San, this way. Got it. What's that eye? This chamber seems to be an experiment facility. Ah, Aman San, Isoyama San, Kuruma Tani. We we were saved, I guess. Where is Shinohara San? We're sorry. Our troops are... Our troops are what? Whoa. Is... Whoa. No way. Is he... That Kagane. Is it that eye patch guy? Is he eating Shinohara? Eye patch bastard. Oh my god. Yes. I'm Amon going up against Kaneki. Yes. 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 Alright, heading into chapter 106 now. Dang, I'm on going in, dude. I'm on going in. Kaneki knocks him back. I'll be back up. I've heard about your efforts at Group Arima, but a wounded woman would only drag him down. Second class investigator motto. Wait for orders, please. This is an order from first class investigator. Roger that. Start preparing the defense system. With that kind of strength, I doubt we can make a good one. Are we doing the S rank one? Nope. We're doing the SS rank one. Oh shit. Here we go. One night. I've always wanted to talk to you. That night, you cried, didn't you? Amon's going in. Was that a lie? I've no clue on what you're talking about. Kaneki has completely forgotten the past, dude. Because he made that change, though. He made that change. Who said you can't? Who, who, alright, I don't know, I have to zoom in. Like, why are these so, the, the text is so small now. Who said you can enter? Father, why is Kazuki over there? I thought he left the facility. Yosuke too, and Aki too. Didn't you say they found foster parents? That was a lie. From now on, I want you to follow me in my lie. Kotaro. With this playing house, finishes. Kotaro. I made some appetizers. You like these, right? The thing that screws up this world is ghouls. This world? But only I know. But but I only want to know one thing. Donata Paropara, the ghoul that eats little children, 
What was the reason why he left me alone even though I was in front of him? What was the reason he didn't kill me? If it's you, if it's you who once let me escape, I thought you might understand something. Don't remember. Can't remember. Don't know. Dude, Kaneki has... Oh my god. E enough. I don't want to hear anymore. K with only one Kuda, I can't. I am a ghoul. Ooh, dang. Daggers being thrown at him by Juzo. Could it be that you in a pinch? Second class Suzia. There are so many of you here. You useless bums. Amon-san! I've come to help. I... Eh? Gimmicks on. Dude, what the... Whoa, what? A Kaguni came out of the blade? The regeneration can't catch up. It's working. Whoa! Cutting is so much fun. Ah! How do I release it again? Eh, eh. He's trying... He doesn't... He doesn't... Juzo doesn't know how to control his own... His kinke. His kinke. <laughs> Kaneki is getting messed up. Oh, and Amon stops the blow. It's okay, right? Just a ghoul. It's okay, right? I... I don't... I don't want to eat anymore. Yeah. Whoa, whoa what's that? Oh, he still smacks him. He still smacks him. You don't have to chase him. Getting Shinohara-san out comes first. That can be done later. Tch. I can feel it. I can feel it. Kaneki-kun is calling for me. It's too wide. We can't find him. It's already been this long. Something must have happened. If only Hanami-chan were here, then she might have known where he is. Kaneki, did you have such a mask before? Banjo-san? Banjo-san, everyone, thank goodness I've come to help. What the heck? No way! Kaneki, what are you doing? He's gone. What? No! Why are you gonna do that to Ben? Oh, no! What? Kaneki, Kaneki, did you have such a mask before? Banjo, son, Banjo, everyone. Thank goodness. I've come to help. What? How are you gonna do that, Kaneki? Kaneki can't control himself anymore. He can't control. He just. Please don't. Please, Banjo. Please do not die. Please do not die. You know what? No. Banjo ain't gonna die. Because he's a ghoul after all. And after all the attacks that he sustained from the Bin brothers in the Algiri arc, being stabbed multiple times, you know, like every other ghoul, he has regenerative powers. If Banjo dies, I'm gonna flip shit. If Banjo dies, I'm gonna flip shit. Alright, let's. Click on the next page. What do we have here? Oh, okay. All right, here comes the last chapter, 107. Let's get into it. Put his whole arm through Banjo, dude. Strike. Dude, Kaneki, how are you going to do that? Kaneki. Banjo-san. Dude, this is bad. This is bad because now they're not going to trust Kaneki whatsoever. Kaneki Gun, return to your senses! What the, what the heck is... What? Wait, hold on, wait, there's small text here. What, what does that, what does that say, what does that say? I have to protect everyone, I have to protect everyone. Can't some other unclear noises? I can do it, I can do it. And some other unclear noises. Huh? Benjo, uh, uh, uh. Dude, Kaneki, what? Why did I strive to be strong? Why did I have, sh what? I Why did I have to shed blood? Why did I throw away my humanity? Why did I have to throw away my weakness? Wasn't it to protect the existence of someone important and to think that I was the one who ruined it? I shouldn't have used an uncontrollable power. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my God, Ka dude, this is too much. This is too much. Kaneki, Banjo Sun, Banjo Sun. Banjo-san! Huh? Oh, there it is. His regenerative power. Banjo's... He's not dead. He's good. The wound is Kagane. Banjo-san is... Are you serious? Yeah, so... So... So eventually... Banjo is going to use his Kagane then, right? Because if he has the regenerative powers, he should be able to use his Kagane. The RC cells are healing the wound. Quick regenerative abilities. 
did the Kokaku respond to the da uh, dangers affecting the body? But to think that Banjo Kun is an Akuku. <laughs> Ukaku! Huh, that hurt. Kagane, mine? Yes! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! He has his Kagane! Yes! So, in the end, while he did, while Kaneki ended up did attacking Banjo, if he didn't do that, Banjo wouldn't have his Kagane back right now. Uh, yes! Now, Banjo, my dog! My dog! So, I healed the wound I got from Eto. Banjo san, I. I. Kaneki. You thought that while carrying everyone's weakness, you have to be even stronger than before. You thought if something happens to a teammate, it's your own fault. You carried all that burden alone without raising a single complaint. It was tough, right? That kind of lifestyle? I'm alright now, so stop torturing yourself. Didn't I say that I'm your shield? Before saying any- before saving anyone else, please, I want you to be saved first. Man. See, this is why I love Banjo. This is why I love Banjo. He freaking realizes Kaneki's internal conflict on what he exactly he is going through, and he is a good leader figure. If you don't like Banjo, I don't know. I, I like him. Banjo, awesome. Kaneki's crying, dude. Kaneki, man, the tragedy, the tragedy. Requesting med team, quick! Shinohara, Shinohara. Dang, actually, dang. Please, just please. Ugh. Sorry, I got blown from the shockwave. I got bitten a bit, but it's okay. I'm alright. Shinohara-san! Uh, excuse me, whoa. Luckily, I was in between the Arata shell and body. He gouged out quite a bit of my body, though. I don't know why, but it looked like he was resisting to eat me. This Arata was only nibbling at me. Maybe he thought he might as well eat someone more appropriate. Thank goodness, I'm a decrepit old man. <laughs> One eye. Juzo, move in pairs during the investigation. If something happens to Shinohara-san, I'm sure you'll start regretting it. Oh, but I won't. Is that a joke? Nope. I think nothing of stuff like those, which why I'll be fine. Which is why I'll be fine. I'm on, he's like, don't you act, this isn't a game. What, you pervert? <laughs> Top class investigator Amon Kotaro. Huh? A cool investigator with a big career behind him who can also be called a bearer of the next generation. But on the uh, another side, he was also raised by a ghoul in the past. An interesting subject matter. Huh. He let one eye Kun escape. Being an investigator, I wonder if that's okay. And one eye Kun being Kakuja's egg won't join us either. Amon son, huh. I'm getting interested in him and in his relationship with one eye Kun too. Compared to the others who keep going with full speed, even when he fails, this one's an interesting one to watch. Thank you, Doctor. I'm sure Takada-san's happy to, uh, to that you... I'm, I'm sure that Takada-san's happy too that you came. I'm only a human, but my purpose is the same with you guys. Let's put each other's advantage to use. CG's inve investigation has come in. I'll dispose on lab's recorded data. Papa, Kuro, what a mess. Hurry up and start eating I, so I can inject you with RC activator. What happened to the ones after you? No more importantly, Papa, please take a look at Shiro. I see. The damage on her Koko, uh, Kokoha I don't know how to pronounce this, I'm sorry. It's more than 70%. It's irrecoverable. Left her and go. The translations. Leave her and go, that's what it says. It's alright, you'll be able to make friends a lot too. Let's go outside through the shortcut. Kuro, come on, I'm leaving you. Let's go home. Kuro. Mmm. My, my, my stomach is hungry. Dude, dude, all right, that about does it for this video, guys, so basically, pretty much what went down was a very, 
a lot of super awesomeness in Tokyo Ghoul. We got a lot of Kaneki just going batshit crazy in these few chapters. We have Rize escaping. We have Rize escaping the doctor's facility. Mado ends up capturing him. Uh, her, excuse me, capturing her and uh, saves her from the doctor from exper from being experimented on to create more artificial ghouls. But Rize san is still alive. What? And she says she's hungry. Rize san is still alive. What the heck? Oh my god. This, this series, I, I think I'm about done with Tokyo Ghoul for today. Like, I've already, like, I, I, I went from, like, chapter, what was it? <laughs> the I, I did the Algiri arc. I went from chapter 49 to, like, 107 now. I'm almost done with Tokyo Ghoul now. Ooh, I need to get some sleep because I've been trying to pump out these videos as uh, soon as I can for you guys uh, to enjoy and I've been losing sleep over this uh, but I, I just want to you know I want to make videos that I can entertain with you guys and you know a lot of you were requesting that you wanted to see a live reaction to what I uh, saw in these few chapters of Tokyo Ghoul so I'm glad I actually got to you know do that for you guys rather than reading uh, the whole of Tokyo Ghoul and then just diving straight into Tokyo Ghoul Re. I'm glad that you guys are enjoying this series and I'm, I'm really I'm really excited to get into Tokyo Ghoul Re. I can't wait. As always, please like the video if you did. If you dislike the video, please like the video if you did. And if you happen to enjoy this video, please let me know your thoughts in the comments down below on what exactly you thought about these few chapters of Tokyo Ghoul that I actually reacted to. Were you like about as surprised as like just to see, you know, Kaneki using the centipede and his he becoming a Kakugan like Oh my god, like, dude, these chapters were hype. These chapters were hype. I'm really glad I got to review uh, to review and uh, do a live reaction to these chapters for you guys. Thank you for everybody who has been supporting me throughout on my channel uh, so far and also supporting these videos that I've been putting out and, you know, just commenting down in general. I love seeing your comments every now and then and they just bring a smile to my face every day. So that about does it for this video, guys. If you want to stay up to date to my future content and possibly see more Tokyo Ghoul related content from me, then please hit that red subscribe button below and you'll never miss a video from me. That about does it for this video, guys. I'm about to go take a nap and probably when I wake up, I'll probably end up finishing Tokyo Ghoul. We'll see, though. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day.